Here we go. Welcome back to Province 8. Yes, sir. Here with Valentine. Hey, Amen. Uh, yeah. Up and coming. Not, I don't even know if you're up and coming, man. You're just a uh, music artist that's out there doing some amazing things right now. Uh, mm. You know, speaking about up and coming, we were picking back up from where we left off, and you've been doing this for a while. Yeah. I mean, and then. Uh, I feel like up and coming is like you're going to be up and coming until you're at the top of the hill anyway. You know what I'm saying? Right. So That's I'm, a good way of looking at it. Yeah. It's a great yeah. way of looking at it, Yeah, actually. you're going to be up and coming until you're on top of the hill and, and you declare you king. You know what I'm saying? Right. So if that ain't your goal, then um, you should stop. So what's your goal? What's your, what's your goal for the next, let's say, the next uh, 12 months, next year? What's your goal? To be the best that I can be. Okay. You feel me? I ain't going to worry about the next person. My family, keep them straight. My kids, they can be straight. Wife, you can be straight. Whatever. Okay. You know. Yeah. But be the best that I can be. Do what I can do. Yeah, I like it. You know? Yeah, and I, I can like do it, it to my fullest potential. I can do it. I can play guitar. I can play piano. I can play drums. I can sing. I can rap. I can write. I can do a number of things, you know? Um, I just got to share that with the world. For all the time that I sat back and I couldn't. When I said I was locked down and I couldn't. I couldn't do nothing for nobody. Right. I couldn't even use the phone when I wanted to. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, for all those times, like, I'm going to just give it out. Because I know what helped me escape that was just this. Learn guitar, this. Learn guitar, this. Right. Play guitar at night, go to sleep, wake up, play right. guitar, eat. Play guitar again, write, sing. You know, every day. All the time. Something. Every time. Just case. stay persistent, stay consistent, stay locked in you can take my attention away from that you can distract me from that you can't there's nothing you can do right you know no i got you i got music you. just like a part of me i might just hear some shit and be like excuse me you know what i mean right. for a second excuse me for a second dismiss right. myself from uh you know whatever activity is going on and and confine myself somewhere where i can just hear myself my thoughts do my thing Right, turn on a studio, just freestyles, and plug in a guitar, freestyle, something, make up a riff. I can do something. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So you, look, the first time I heard you, uh, you were playing the guitar. You're talking about playing the guitar, you're talking about uh, being locked down, right? Um, tell us a little bit about being locked down. Tell us oh. about that experience. Yeah. Tell us. Uh, my understanding is I'm, I'm, you know, I don't mean to steer you or lead you, but my understanding is that you learned to play guitar while you were locked down. Tell us, tell us a little mm -hmm. bit about that. Oh, I think man. you're amazing on the guitar, bro. You know, you can. Uh, people think going to jail or going being in prison or whatever is like, you know, this horrible thing, and it can be. This is what you make it. You know what I'm saying? You got a bunch of different diversity from a bunch of different places from this. Gang, that gang, this set, you know what I mean? This black, so, you know, it's it's kind of like the same thing that you would see in the regular world, though. It's kind of how you move about. You don't really got to be entangled and taught that shit. I wasn't even really there in my mind. I was like, everybody loved me because I did music. I was like, I just did it. Man, that, he fire. He go crazy. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. And then that, that praise, that congrats, that. Cause if you if you can if you can do the kind of music I do in the prison setting, in the jail setting, and the people them some of the hardest critics in there, they really don't give a damn. They got 10, 20, 30, 40 years. They right. really don't got time to listen to what you got to play. Right. You know what I'm saying, but to get their attention, to get their praise, to hear them like they would clap. They would. I'm like, damn, they clapping. <laughs> we in prison. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, it was. A, it was. A, I was right. like, damn. Okay. Right. I'm, I, I must okay. got some. Yeah. And I knew I had something that whole time. I knew I had, it, but I didn't never let it out. I was afraid to let it out or something. I don't know. I, I don't even know if I was afraid to let it out. It was more like a not committing okay to my craft right so i just figured shit out when i get out of here i'm gonna just commit to my craft that's what i'm gonna do that's what i'm gonna do i i believe this is the right path well hey man we're glad that you uh that's what you're committing to because i i think the music is amazing yeah uh it's Thank you, uh it's extremely Thank you, talented you helped me put a few projects together well, if y'all don't know um brother ezra helped us help i put together a few projects he is a wonderful sound engineer he's got an ear he can produce it he can mix it do, do. 
He has helped put us together a wonderful song. I'm going to go perform it soon. It's called Better Than You Know. I love yeah, it. it amazing. I love that song. Yeah, man. Yeah, and uh, like That song is going to capture a whole lot of people's hearts and atten attention, definitely, for sure. Right. But I believe I, so. Yeah, it's going to capture a lot of people's hearts. I believe hearts. so. Because a lot of times I don't even write music for myself. Right. What 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 uh what encourages you to write? What what where, where do some I, I, of the I, concepts come from, man? Uh, man you, know, you leave what, me what, sitting in this room long enough, I'll start writing. What's the it's message? Just, what's the message you're trying to get to people? What's the, what's your message for 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 the world? What's your, what's your message for for the person that listens to your song? That's standing outside. Good evening, the door. ladies and gentlemen. My name is Valentine. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Valentine. Yeah. Nah, uh, I feel like I feel like what you want I can people? touch everyone, right? Because right. I can write music so many different ways, right? Related to so many different things, you know. Right. I don't want to just make music about love or my love life or my, you know what I'm saying? I want to relate to people, right? So a lot of times I might have a conversation with somebody or something, learn about them, and that may be a inspiration to, or I might say hello to someone, you know what I mean? And that might light a fire, you know what I'm saying? Just right. give me that, you know. But with the message to the word, I feel like everybody goes through different situations. That's what came with skeletons. Then I had easy. I feel like they'll feel that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. The ladies will feel that. Yeah. And you know, it's easy. You know what I'm saying? Right. It, it, it was. It sounds good. Right. Right. But right. Then you see. You then you hear skeletons. It's like, man, that's. A, is that even him? That sounds like a whole like a different. Whole different you see what Artist. I'm saying? You see what I'm saying? Right. So I like to relate to people. And a lot of times I may ask someone, hey, write me a letter. Just write me a letter. They'd be like, what you mean? Write a letter to me. Like okay. he was writing me a letter. Yeah. Tell, tell me your thoughts and feelings towards me. Okay. Or tell me your thoughts and feelings towards someone else. Write me something. Write me a letter. Because off a letter, I can read it straight. I read and what, turn it into a song? Yeah. Okay. I, that, I do that a lot. Okay. I tell people to write me a letter. Wow. Whatever you write to me, I'll take and make me write into someone else through a song. Got it. So you're able to take someone's story and make a song out of and it. And make a song out of it. That's amazing. Most people and don't. And then a lot of times with me doing that, I discover something inside of me right. that I can relate to about that. Right. And I combine them both. Like, how, how about I do this? Hmm. I think more than one person. That's two different people's thought patterns running i think that that would attract more than one or two people though right no i mean that's attractive to everybody that's up there. Exactly. That, that could be anybody that exactly. wrote that letter to you Exa right exactly could be anybody exactly. That it could be that anything it could be anything right. i might read something like i'm just gonna write i'm just gonna write i know there's something inside of me that gotta come out i gotta get music out i got to i feel it it's in my bones i wake up in the morning i feel it sometimes i can't go to sleep i got drums in my head playing i'm like man i gotta get up and press pause or play on something you know what i'm saying it's it's it's, it's a part of me like art right right well, it's like therapy right art yeah you're an artiste <laughs> yeah i say that because you were an artist in just one or two things you are a real artiste right you're a jack of all trades just like you right sometimes you may not feel good that morning sometimes you wake up lay there and on a night you didn't really get a full night sleep or whatever right. right your day don't really be that you know what i'm saying really positive uplifting people right? getting on you your nerves the obstacles you know what I'm that come getting your way right you ain't called me in 275 right. days and then all of a sudden you, you call me what yeah, does this popping mean up. yeah what does this mean you start thinking off my something algorithm of the day you know what i'm saying <laughs> and you might just be all sitting up when get you get it. some free time or some long some time you pull out something i guarantee you probably start painting or decorating or yeah. you will start doing something because yeah. it's, it's healing it's settling it's healing yeah it's healing to me right it's healing to me and so i love the people that listen to it i love the people that consider themselves real fans i love all my valentines my exos you know uh it's all about love you know that's where that's where that came from you know exo gang was like a little click we were just a little bit you know we were just the fly some of us you know Got relationships or married or you know then it's the single the players you know right, what I mean the right. baddies you know what I'm saying right. that was like it was just a little small thing EXO gang it was just our little thing and that's okay. how it's growing it's like okay 
And so, I want to make sure this I'm sp- putting a right message out to him. Right. And it's about love. I don't right. really do nothing else. So, so the EXO gang uh-huh. started off with family. Nah. And then you extended it to the rest of the world and, and pulled the rest nah, of the world nah, in with nah, family. Nah, nah, no, EXO gang was just like my little fly clique that I went out with okay, every weekend. So that's weekend. not like your sisters and your brother and, and like your internal family? Well, I mean, now I know they you kind of refer to them as EXO gang too, right? Well, I know, you know. Oh, they just, that's because, because they I mean, back you, you know up. it's got to be, come on now. That's, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's because they back you up too, huh? Yeah, I mean, come on, man. You know they're going to be, I mean, anything that's positive that I'm doing, right. I, don't, I don't see how anybody can be a part of it. Okay. Well, I'm asking that because, you know, before we got this whole thing going on, uh, you and your sister uh-huh. were sitting here at this table. That's your sister, right? Now, yeah, you call her uh, yeah. twin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's right? my sister, yeah. Is it t- now, is, is it that, is, are you guys twins? Because you guys look exactly alike. Are you twins, twins, or are you just call a twin no, because we, you we guys just, look so much alike? We, yeah, what that's why. That's why. Okay. We're just twins. That's okay. why we do it, man. Okay, you know, we, you. we're a few years apart, but we just so much okay, like each other, you know. Man, just, I, man, you it's guys, always been you had, twin. You had me confused when I first saw it. I thought y'all was like, you know, born at the. Uh, like, uh, well, yeah, let's just keep it with that. 30, it's 30 good. seconds apart or something. That was the idea of it. It's working. Yeah, man. Uh, but but no, but no. Seriously though, you guys were uh sitting here at the black table, and uh, you guys had a little little rendition that you you ran through. Tell me a little bit because that, that was hot. That was yeah, like we like we need to we need to record that right now. You know, I was going to ask you Let's that. Go. You know, because that's like seven years, eight years in the making. That was 2000. Okay. It's 2023. It's June. That had to be like early 2017, like early. Okay. Maybe Is that the like, only song you got with it? No, nah, we got a few. We got, we've had songs over the years. Like, we was just never putting them out like that. Like, okay. Not that if we didn't want to, isn't that we didn't really know how. Got you. We were still young. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Right. We weren't really as passionate. Right. We weren't really as locked in. I'm locked in like a, a lion. I'm trying to find the next baboon. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying that, that, to get it. That's a good analogy. <laughs> yeah, I'm God trying to dang, get it. That's you know cool. what I'm saying? Right. That's good. I'm trying to get it. And, uh, but I don't really I don't really do nothing outside of the circle like that, man. I okay. kind of just do my own thing. And, uh, you know, I, I keep it fly. I keep it kosher with everybody. You know what I mean? Right. We, just, we just be chilling. It's all good. But, um, yeah, she's she's definitely a singer. Okay. When you think about Demaya Marie, you think about Demaya XO or whatever, you hear her voice. She's, you're like, okay, she can sing. You know what I'm saying? Right. But you get her behind a project and you get her locked in. It's like, you know, some people that can sing and then you got the people that can sing. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like old Southern Baptist church. You know right. what I'm saying? Sing it. You know what right. I mean? Right. And when that comes out of her, that's just like, you know what I mean? Thank the Lord. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm glad it's my sister. You know I was what I'm glad saying? I was able to receive it. Yeah, yeah right, man. I'm right, glad it's right. my sister. Uh, right. But, um, yeah, man, that's that's a beautiful thing. We we definitely need to do some work. Yeah, that's awesome. We definitely do some work. So so before we give the you see our sand you see our you see you see uh, our our crew over there. You see the sound guy. He's uh he's waving me down because he's like, hey man, if you keep on if you keep on punching that microphone, um you know we're not gonna be able to do anything with this conversation that we're having right now, man. So the sound guy's saying, hey man, be uh be, be careful with the black table because that microphone's picking up everything that you do. <laughs> Uh, I, I was hey man, that's what me. happens when you when you start stepping up over here in province hey. eight, man. We got sound guys and camera guys. Look at all this good stuff, my bad, man. man. This my is bad. good. This is good, right? My bad, my bad, um, man. But uh, this is growth, man. This is what growth looks like, man. So so it's good. We was giving the sound guy. I know. Hey, look, <laughs> look, Greg. I'm sorry. It's Greg. all we're, good, we're man. We're trying. We're trying, Greg. Um, but uh, but no. Uh, so your sister, you play the guitar. Does your sister play an instrument, or is the instrument uh, just really her vocals? Tell me a little her bit. What's going on? Like her vocals and her creativity. Gotcha. Like I, I learned, but I already knew how to play certain instruments. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like before I started singing, I was like learning how to play instruments and make beats and all that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. She was the one really singing. I wouldn't really do too much singing. I let her sing, and okay. I just be, you right. know what I'm saying? Right. Getting it. <laughs> but uh. She can she can mess around with the guitar. That's okay. a good, I think guitar is like a universal thing for us. But yeah, man, she's she's dope. talented, huh? She's that's dope. good. It's she's hey, man, dope, look, man. it's good that you're out here making some amazing music 
family is intertwined with the music. It's like music is just in your blood and surrounding you. And my mother's son gospel. And your mother's son gospel. Yeah. Okay. So wow. I, I got to see her stand on stage too. So I was like, oh man, that's that's really you, you like. You come from a musically oriented family. I mean, is is that where the inspiration initially? Where did the, in, the that's inspiration? Like, that's like the initial because I feel from. like when I seen that, if I seen my mom go on stage and sing in front of all these people. I know I can do this. Right. And this is what I want to do because I ain't never seen nothing like it. was like I seen like the, the light shining. You know what I'm saying? I was like just stuck. Like, right. wow. And she blowing them away. Right. Like wow. everybody quiet. Everybody teared up. Their hair standing up on the back of their right. neck. You know what I'm saying? Right. That's awesome. Like, man, that's what I can do this. I want to do this. It's, I mean, maybe not the type of music she's doing, but I want to do this in some way, shape, or fashion. Got you. So, so did you did you take that inspiration and go learn? I mean, did you have any like formal training uh, musically, or is this like your self taught? Uh, you you learn by ear, play by ear. Tell me a little bit yeah, about. I can't even the, read music. It, okay. You try to get me to read some music. I'm a. I might <laughs> look at you crazy. You know what I'm saying? Right. I don't need it. I, I don't. I don't know how. Okay. So what I can hear though, or what I can make up me hear, I can play it. If I I think I know what it sound like. I can play it. If I just go in there goofing around, I'm gonna end up playing it. Right, right. I'm like, okay, this sound cool. Record this. All right, next. Or just jam out. Do what I do. Gotcha. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, that just inspiration. And then seeing the, the artist before me, right? First of all, when I was growing up, I loved Lil Wayne. Love Lil Wayne. Okay. I was a Lil Wayne fan. You okay. know what I'm saying? Yeah. Not just because his music, but you see the imagery of Lil Wayne and how they was shooting his videos and how he was, you know, Lollipop, he hanging out the limo. Yeah. I'm eating yeah. Cinnamon Toast Crush. I'm like, right. That's inspiration for you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because oh, you, yeah. you, 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 yeah, like you, you relate to it. Mm, yeah. You feel me? Right. Uh, Eminem, you know, Jay Z, uh, Rick Ross, a lot of even Kendrick, even uh, J. Cole, you know, a lot of the rappers, and I relate to the singers as well. John okay. Legends, yeah. Chris Browns, and yeah. Toy Lanez, and yeah. you know, so on and so forth. Right. You know, I relate to all that. I feel like everybody got a craft, right? And the craft and the industry that we in, you know what I'm saying? There's levels to it, of course. But to see other people doing it and it's sounding good, I'm loving it. You know what I mean? I get inspired as well. I'm like, oh man, that's good. It's not like, I don't look at it like it's incapable, but I look at it like, when will I do it? Gotcha. Okay. Because this I, is I like that. they're doing it because this is what they love. Right. They good at it. Right. They really good at it. Yeah. I'm really good at it. Yeah. That's confident. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. That sounds confident, I'm man. Do it. That's how you feel about it, right? Uh, that's what it is. That's amazing. I, I'm. I'm gonna do it. That's amazing. You know what I'm saying?